Cooper, Allie, CJ, so nice meeting you yesterday. Thanks for coming to the house for the, fir for the first lesson. I wanted to go over that first lesson just to make sure that you're, you're practicing at home the correct way. The first thing we did was the folk strum, and we did it on an E minor chord. An E minor, look, I can get closer to you now. An E minor chord, all right? And the folk strum sounds like this. Down, down, up, up, down, up. Down, down, up, up, down, up. Notice my hand, it's just going up and down. But I only strum down, down, up, up, down, up. Down, down, up, up, down, up. Second part, after you do that two trillion times, um, is E minor and G. E minor, again, and G, again. It's on your worksheets, E minor, twice, G, again. E minor. stays there and you move this finger to the third fret first string I'm a little out of tune I can hear it finally the four chords this is after days of practicing maybe even not until the second lesson if you get bored with G, E minor, if you're doing well on it, um, then you go on to the four chords. G, E minor, C, and D. G. E minor. Take your time. C. Right to that E minor, keep your right hand moving. If you can, keep your right hand moving. Go to that C chord, and then the D chord. That's the more advanced part of our first lesson. But our first lesson really is this right here. See you next week.